A seven-story building in Nairobi's Kahawa West area collapsed on Sunday morning, sparking fears that people may be trapped under the rubble. Rescue teams were immediately dispatched to the scene as authorities launched a search and rescue operation. According to police, it is not yet clear if any occupants were inside the building at the time of the collapse. Residents had earlier detected signs of structural weakness and had mobilized to evacuate the building, potentially preventing a greater tragedy. The Kenya Red Cross and the Nairobi County government confirmed the incident with response teams deployed to the site. Patrick Mbogo, Nairobi County Executive for the Built Environment, stated that occupants of nearby buildings would also be evacuated as a precautionary measure. The building, which housed residential units and businesses, including an Equity Afia clinic, had been occupied for less than a month. Reports suggest that residents were warned just hours before the collapse, raising serious concerns about the building's approval and construction standards. Nairobi police boss Adamson Bungay confirmed that some residents had been evacuated before the collapse. We are not sure if there were still people inside, but I know an evacuation had taken place after they identified weaknesses in the structure, he said. Multi-agency teams were sent to assist in the search and rescue efforts. There are fears that two construction workers employed by the building's owner may have been on site during the collapse as their whereabouts remain unknown. The Nairobi City County government has also confirmed the collapse of the building, located along Station Road in Kahawa West. County teams are fully engaged in disaster recovery and evacuating residents from adjacent buildings. The County Planning Department had issued an evacuation notice last week, warning occupants of the building's instability. As the rescue mission continues, Questions are being raised about the approval process and the parties responsible for ensuring the safety of the building's construction.